Welcome to the series of data analysis using Excel. This is Dr. Atman Shah. In this video, I'm going to discuss three functions, average, average if, and average ifs. You can find more videos on Excel, SPSS, RStudio, Econometrics, Mathematical Economics, Statistics, and Economics on my YouTube channel. So don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon. Now let's begin with the average function. Average function is used to find the arithmetic mean of particular variable. So here I have the hypothetical data of uh, 11 students, their marks, gender and stream. So let's find the mean of marks. So I can write is equal to average and in bracket we can select the range. So you select this range. So here from B2 to B12 the range is selected and you simply press enter you will get the mean, arithmetic mean. Now, suppose we want to find the mean marks of male students only. So therefore, we are adding one condition that compute the mean mark for only male student. Since we, are, we have only one condition, we use average if function. So here, now we want to find the mean marks of male students so we can write is equal to average if you can see the function is average if in bracket first we need to select the range so here the range is gender that is that is known as criteria range now we need to define the criteria. So you press comma and then write the criteria in double inverted comma that is male. So first is criteria range that is gender. In gender the category is male and now you uh, specify the average range that is the variable for which we want to compute the mean. So select marks. You see the entire function again. The function is average if first is our criteria range. So here criteria range is gender. Then you define the category that is male. And then the average range, the range for which we want to calculate the mean. You simply press enter. You will get the answer. It is 35.25. If you want to find it for female, you can write uh, female in the category. Now suppose we want to uh, add one more condition. Mean marks of male arts students. So we have two conditions and therefore we use average ifs function. So male students plus arts. Two conditions are there. So the function is average ifs. Because we have two condition. So first you define the average range. So our average range is marks. Then we need to define the criteria range one. So our first criteria range is gender. So we select gender. Then we define the criteria. So you can write male in double inverted comma. So our first criteria is defined. Now you select the criteria range 2. So criteria range 2 is stream, comma. Then you define another criteria that is arts and close the bracket. So check your function again. First is average range, the variable for which you want to uh, calculate the mean. Then criteria range 1, that is gender. In gender, the criteria is male. Then criteria range 2, that is a stream, and in stream it is arts. And you simply press enter. You will get the answer. So this is how you can use average, average if, and average ifs function. If you find this video useful, kindly like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.